Thank you. Oh, uh, now I would like to invite His Excellency uh, Mahmoud Tab uh, Tabit Kombo, Ambassador of Tanzania, to deliver our uh, opening remark. Thank you. Excellencies at the high table, dear participants, my brothers and sisters, buongiorno tutti. I'm learning Italian, so I've learned for three months, and I must admit I'm good now. Io parlo poco poco. I would like to extend on behalf of the United Republic of Tanzania, our sincere greetings from our president, Madam Samia Sulu Hassan, who is fully aware that I am here today because I had to report and inform accordingly about this event and the importance of this event to all of us. So I would like to thank the organizers Fratelli Tutti and uh, all the participants for honoring a great man that among all his uh, praises, you forgot to mention one which is our father of the nation. He is also my father of the nation, of my nation, which is my main identity. And all Tanzanians in this room, ni baba etwa taifa. So he's our father of the nation, and he earned that title. Call it politically, call it government, but he earned that title, and that title is there to stay forever. So greetings from the president, our president, Madam Samia Sulu, but also from the family, who wanted to join with us, family of late Mualim Nyerere. The son was uh, already nominated by the family, Dr. Makongoro Nyerere to join with us today, but unfortunately, due to some unavoidable circumstances, he couldn't make it, but he was supposed to be with here us uh, today. So I will start with these greetings so that you accept them, and uh, on behalf of the United Republic of Tanzania, we fully support the symposium or colloquium that you have decided to pick this great man, not to us Tanzanians, not to East Africans, not to SADC, not to Africa, but globally, because we can see different nationalities who are here today, and some of them appointed as uh, origins of Tanzania from what you have presented, so thank you very much. Secondly, when I received this invitation, I shared with my other 49 colleagues who are ambassadors of the United Republic of Tanzania around the world. Uh, we are 50, all of us together. And I shared with uh, them immediately the poster plus uh, this image in our group. These days, the so-called WhatsApp chat group. <laughs> we have ambassadors chat group. And uh, we discuss Many, many things. The things that you discuss in church, the things that are going on globally, and everyone presents their discussion, including our ambassador who is based in uh, Jerusalem. We have an embassy in Jerusalem. This season he writes the most than most of us. So we read, and as diplomats we are regulated in what we say and what we speak. But one key ambassador wrote to me privately. They call it these days inbox. <laughs> they wrote to me privately and said, how come it's only two, Mwalimu Julius Nyerere, a politician with soul, and Mwalimu Nyerere, a servant of God. Mwalimu Nyerere is more to us. I will read extras that he wrote 
to leave it to you all as a challenge when you discuss about Mwalimu Nyerere if you feel comfortable and if you will agree with my colleagues you can add on top of that and I'll mention a few because the list was very long besides politician with soul and a servant of God my colleagues said he was a liberator because he liberated us not only United Republic of Tanzania there are many countries who are also present in this room which I will not mention because they will speak for themselves but once Mwalimu said we Tanzanians are not going to be free if others in the neighborhood are not free hatutokuwa huru ikiwa jirani zetu na wenzetu hawakupata uhuru and one good friend of uh, of Kenya my good friend Kenya I have a lot of good friends Kenya we call them watani sometimes says you Tanzania don't speak uh, good uh, english as we do Kenyans and i said also you don't speak good swahili as we speak <laughs> and uh, number two, i said you said english but you are kenyan i said swahili because i am mswahili so i had a, a privilege over over the other language so besides Mwalimu being a liberator he liberated us also from all that tribalistic and ethnicity that we had in the country and united us with one language today this language has won an international uh, status and uh, almost all of us including my brother councillor from uh, Burundi he speaks Swahili uh, he speaks Swahili good swahili <laughs> sanifu <laughs> and uh, and uh, we are trying also to unite our region like many other regions with our language so besides liberator mwalimu was a ambassador of swahili in the region pan africanist true african independence seeker because he is the one who negotiated independence for our country i don't know i was a bit late i don't know if you mentioned the malimu period where he was a prime minister before becoming a president there was a short period that mwalimu nyerere was a prime minister i hope you are going to discuss about that because that was a very important period of tanganyika free tanganyika before mwalimu became a president and then mze rashid mfaume kawawa became the prime minister so i hope as a keynote uh, opening remarks i like also to leave some challenges for discussion besides the father of the nation our international figure and a governor who governed positively because uh, politician not all politicians have governed I know several politicians who are in opposition they've never been part of government since our country was born wale walokuwa katika vyama vya upinzani wengine hawakushika serikali si ndio na mpaka wataishia wengine si rahisi kwa sababu sifa ya mwanasiasa the, the politician and governance is a, you can defy a bit so besides being a servant of god he governed with good faith of uh, and directions of god so we are here to celebrate mwalimu nyerere and i'm here to join you and uh, please rest assured our embassy is there to support you fully in uh, such occasions of honoring and remembering this great leader of africa for us for our government of the united republic of tanzania for our president madam samia sulu hassan we have decided that all embassies of the united republic of tanzania will have also cultural centers 
which will be propagate, propagating our Swahili culture and language. And uh, I'm very proud to say in Roma, which is my station, we have opened an official Swahili class that in honoring Mwalimu Nyerere, because he united the country. <laughs> he united the country with a common language. Today, excellencies, we don't ask a person, where are you from? What is your tribe? What is your ethnicity? Kabila la konani. We don't ask them, Nani, what is your religion? What is your madhebu sect? Or where you originating from? No. We are identified as Tanzanians. We are identified as East Africans. We are identified as Africans because of Mwalimu Nyerere. This class that we have started, we are providing the Swahili service like others who had uh, provided Swahili service before us. And uh, the two lecturers from this class are here today. And I would like you to see them for those with good reading. I don't know, how about your Swahili is good? No. <laughs> so you better join the class. Naomba walimwetu wa Kiswahili wa Simami pale obalozini. Bwana Leons nabi... Anastasia, these are our two Swahili uh, uh, teachers or professors, I can call them, because they were verified by the official body of Swahili, in, you call it Swahili in English, but it is Kiswahili, Bakita, Barasa la Kiswahili, Tanzania. So with these few words said, I would like once again, to thank you very much for involving our embassy. We feel very proud to be associated with Mwali Munyerere always, because without him, we wouldn't have been here. One of the other ambassadors said, if he had those things that you mentioned, stealing money, taking money, stealing money, etc., we today wouldn't have been standing here. It would have been a different altogether. We are standing here with suit and tie, nice ties, because of what uh, they did. They didn't scrap off anything. We must give them their praise. They tried to save as much as possible and leave us a lesson that we should also leave for others who will come after us, our children, our grandchildren, and our future generation. So I'm not alone. I'm here with our embassy staff who have accompanied me and they are here. I would like them to stand with their families. Naomba msimame wale wote mnotokea obalozi wa Jamhuri ya Muungano wa Tanzania. Na wenza wenu naomba msimame ili muonekane. Hawafahamu Kiswahili vizuri eh? So I'm not alone. You can see I'm not alone. Asanteni sana na washukuru wakuja. Uh, now I'll speak Swahili also to honor this great man. Besides as a servant of God and a, and a politician, also a propagator of a Swahili language as our national identity and national unifying factor. Naomba ndugu zangu wote mnaongea Kiswahili. Nichukue fursa hii kuwapongeza sana kwa jambo hili. Naomba sana Tuchukue kauli ya wole soyinka. Wole soyinka, this I'll have to say in English because others have to listen as well and uh, understand me. Wole soyinka said, if we don't tell our own stories, if we don't tell our own success, who are you depending on to tell your, your story and who are you depending on to tell your success? Kama hatuja yaelezea hadithi yetu wenyewe, unamtarajia nani aje kukuelezea hadithi yako wewe. Kwa sabu na ya na hadithi yake. Na ye pia tataka kusema ya kwake. Kama sifa zenu hamja zitagazia nyinyi wenyewe, unatarajia nani aje kukwambene sifa zenu. Mwalimu Nyerere is the son of Tanzania. Mwalimu Nyerere is not only the son of Butiama, 
but is the son of whole East Africa. Mwalimu Nyerere is the son of Africa and Mwalimu Nyerere is the son of this world. We all together should cherish what you have. This is the wealth that we have and we have to look for the future for such exemplary leaders that we, the current generation and the future generation should follow. These are all that I have in my opening remarks. Once again, thank you very much for inviting me here and I feel very honored and privileged to be with all of you. And for those servants of God, please, when you say your prayers, do remember us as well. Thank you.